what's good guys it is your boy jason jv saying welcome to another wwe 2k 22 my rise video and yeah just checking my volume levels here right quick and it looks like we are ready little freddy now as y'all can probably tell i'm wearing my latino heat you know what i'm saying eddie guerrero t-shirt you know what i mean that i got for christmas this past christmas that is you know what i'm saying got the sport my my favorite green bandana too while we're at it and yeah now as y'all know picking up from where we left off uh we are now uh part of the uh smackdown roster so we're gonna go ahead and get this party started by talking to uh mark for life let's go i tried to tell lacey evans what a fan i am of the woman's right but she just called me a nasty laughed and walked away any chance i could persuade you to stick up for me I guess I am a bit nasty, but I'm not a nasty. There's a difference. Mm. I still don't think that's the right uh, character for Lacey Evans. They should give her, since, since she has a military background, I mean, it would make all the sense in the world for her to have, like, a, milita a militaristic type of character. You know what I mean? A tactical character. <clears throat> now that we can um, customize... Uh, they're gonna be super size. Maybe what I'll do is um, I'll give Lacey Evans a new persona that reflects on her military background. And if Lacey Evans happens to be watching, or someone close to her happens to be watching, and I can show her this, let me just say, uh, appreciate the uh, service, Lacey. Greatly appreciated. Booyah! Booyaka! <clears throat> so the woman's wrong storyline we did complete. And I had a feeling it was going to turn me into a face. That's alright though. I mean, we've been a heel long enough, you know, towards the end of our run uh, with NXT. So I don't mind coming into SmackDown as, as, a, as a heel and... Getting a nice little baby face run in, you know what I'm saying, bruh. We did a listener poll recently on my podcast, and turns out they'd be pretty pumped to see an Iron Woman match on SmackDown. Want to give the people what they want? You know we all about giving the people what they want, so let's go. You need to calm your damn rolls, Cole. It done. And pin attempt. Nice. Let's go. Power bomb. Let's go. Yeah. Look at that. Four to zero. Come on now. Come here. <laughs> oh, hell no. Nope. Oh, nice. And a fall. Let's go. Oh, hell. Want to eat another pinfall? Let's go. Stop it. <laughs> Nine to zero. One more. One more for the road. And then we're going to pin this time. Two, 
10-0, let's go. <clears throat> 11 to 0. That's crazy. I'm trying to see how many pinfalls I can get at this point. Let's go, ref. do it couldn't resist <clears throat> I'm trying to get one count out fall here let's go That's right on the outside. Let's go. Come on, ten. Ah, oh, time's up anyway. <laughs> nice. Look at that, she's already outside of the ring, so we, we good. Power to the pole, people. Yeah, that, that don't sound uh, suggestive. So we are now about to talk to Josie Jane. Oh yeah, we catching up with an old, old rival of ours. So let's go ahead and uh, get to talking with little Miss Josie and see what, see what she got going on. Ugh, I knew it was impossible to avoid you much longer. Hmm. Let's see here. Nice to see you too. Or thought I smelled something. <laughs> nah, we'll, we'll be nice. We'll be nice. Nice to see you too, Josie. How have you been? Let's dispense with the pleasantries, okay? Thankfully, so far, we've been able to stay out of each other's way for the most part. But as we both climb the ranks of SmackDown, that's not going to be an option anymore. And there's only room for one of us at the top. Hmm. I'm glad we get to continue our rivalry. Enjoy the view from down below. Agreed. And I have to admit, it's pretty cool that we're going to be able to continue our rivalry from the PC here on SmackDown. I came to compete against the best. And more and more, that's looking like it might be you. <laughs> Might be? Is. And if you need proof, I'm happy to get in the ring with you anytime. Why wait? Let's go. I look forward to seeing what skills you've picked up since the PC. And showing you a few new ones of my own. Let's do this. Alright, so if we complete the story, we unlock some piercings. So let's go ahead and get right into this damn thing. I can hit hit. Go. Yo, we get to talk to OHBK. Let's see what he got going on. Well, looks like I picked the right week to visit <clears throat> SmackDown. I hear you and Josie are getting in the ring. Yep, should be fun. Let me offer you some advice and you can do what you like with it. I know a lot about deep-rooted feuds and squaring off versus someone from Calgary. Oh, boy. There are a lot of ways to win, but the choices you make will determine kind of superstar fans see you as mm, he would have to bring up that certain uh rivalry that led up to a um a certain type of job if you know what i mean um yeah that that, that was done in montreal you know what i'm saying and uh yeah but it, it, it's been told that's what i've been told to death so the less said about that now the better makes sense so the question is you take Josie out in the ring, or do you get her before she even makes it there? 
Ooh, we can turn. We, we can stay baby face, or we can turn heel in this story. Nah, we 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 gonna we gonna stay face, so we can knock out all the baby face stories, and then we'll turn heel afterwards. I can take her in the ring, and I'm not going to give her any additional reason to complain about the results. Right? Probably smart. Now you just gotta make sure you win. So you y'all do realize, right, that with this character, you know. Uh, being that this character is from WWE 2K20, that means 2K20 is canon, which is rather unfortunate, because that story was ass. <laughs> Lightweight. Elbow drop from the top. Let's go. Get your ass on up. How dare you botch the finish? Get up! Well, yeah, we done. <clears throat> See, that match between Alice and Josie was fire. I agree. Keep it up, ladies. PC pride. <clears throat> and then Trish starts with 100. I think we just saw the start of a significant rivalry. Hmm. Oh, uh -oh, Booker T, Mr. Five Time himself says, brought back fun memories of... My best, uh, my best of five series with Cena, or at least fond memories of matches two and three. Oh, and Cena in the mix, talking about if you only remember two and three, it's not, it's not a best of five Booker. Say what? If you only remember two and three, it's not a best of five Booker. Ha. Those were some epic matches. Hopefully, we're witnessing something like that starting here. No pressure, Alice Anderson or Josie Jane. Let's go. And then Scrap Daddy says, The matchup of Alice Anderson and Josie Jane was outstanding. And now, Booker T and John Cena have my wheels turning. Oh, Nelly! I hope you're not spending too much time celebrating or reading your mentions on social media. I'm not. In this sport, it's all about the next match. That next match is going to be the same as your last, but with a different result. I just talked to Adam Pierce, and we're doing a best of three series. Only three? That's weak. Nice of him to let me know. I'm letting you know now. And I'll let you know that I'm going to beat you twice to prove who's ready to take their career to the next level. Unless you can't handle that kind of pressure. I'm happy to give you another chance. Because I know I can handle the pressure. And I know I can beat you again. And again. It's only and going again. to help my case and again. as I work towards being SmackDown Women's Champion. Hmm. We'll see. Oh yeah, we shall see. <clears throat> match one was fire. Can't wait for match two in this best of three series on SmackDown at Alice Anderson and at Josie Jane, the sequel. Uh-oh, let's go. Let's do this. Damage Josie Jane with attack, so she's going to win this one. Woohoo! <laughs> All right, now what? Hit Josie with a strike while she is down. Well, hold on. A little parting gift for her. Oh, 
Oh, armbar. Ah, oh, it's a smudge. It's a smudge finish. She tapped as my girl's shoulders were pinned. Wow. That's right. Just walk away, girl, because we're, we're, we're still babyface. We still want to be uh, babyface for a good minute. Extending this rivalry was absolute genius. Whose idea was that again? That's right. Mine. Egotistical much? Technically, it was Booker T and John Cena's idea, but sure. Way to go. Facts. You know, it wouldn't hurt to compliment your boss every now and then. Might earn you some bonus points. She doesn't need bonus points. She won. It was a close finish, but I've got to respect the referee's call. I'm going to have to dig deep to take the third match. You both will. And with that in mind, your final deciding match of the best of three series will be an Iron Woman match. Okay. We've competed against each other so many times in the past that this seems fitting. I could have thought of something better. Right, bonus points. Um, good idea, boss. <laughs> Keep working on that. <laughs> uh, gotta admire the uh, sarcasm from Josie Jane. I'm not gonna lie. Spear! Right out the gate! Damn it. And, yeah. Oh, you're going to give me my, my first fall, girl. Let's go. There we go. One to zero. Let's go. Oh. Nope. Get your ass back in that corner. And come on, fall number two. Thank you. And splash. Number three. Oh. See, see if we can hit the power bomb. Number four. Yahtzee. Got it. Number five. <laughs> yeah. And now we're going to go for number seis. Numero seis. Oh, yeah. What do you mean? Oh, crap. Oh, hell no. Get off. Where do you get off? Trying to take me out with a sharpshooter, huh? Oh, hell. Oh, so I see. She can attack my legs, but I can't attack her legs. Is that how this game works? Hmm. Is that how it is? Well, screw that. Putting her ass in a Boston crab. Number seven.
You little so and so. You know, we can get counted out um, all we want, but she's still going to be behind. Spear! Powerbomb. Uh oh. Oh, you can go up this way too if you want. <laughs> Ball number nine. That was a fail. Oh, hell. I think that was her finisher. Nope. Not enough damage. All right. I think we can do the comeback. Yes, we got the comeback. Let's go. Ooh, that's the other sig. Let's go. Let's try this again. I caught shenanigans on that one. Nope. Let's go. My turn now. Let's go. Oh yeah, we showing off now. That's right, get back in this ring and take that spear. <laughs> Woo! Nice kick to the face. And who are you? That's right. Combo. Booyah. Power bomb. Let's go. Eleven to zero. Thirty seconds left. Not enough time. Let's go. One. <laughs> Time's up. Couldn't get her finisher in time. <laughs> Let's go. Woo. Sorry, Josie. Close, but no cigar. Listen, I don't know when we might meet in the ring again. But it's clear that neither you or I are going anywhere. You think? I know I'm not going anywhere anytime soon. Right. It's also clear that this rivalry isn't going away either. You're going to get some wins. I'm going to get some wins. Uh-huh. I don't see any of that changing. But the one thing that has changed is that after that series, I certainly have gained a lot of respect for you and your abilities. Hmm. Thank you. I appreciate you saying that. We might have had our differences, but I want you to know I've got your back. No matter what. And I hope when push comes to shove, if I ever need it, you'll have mine too. Yeah, hey, hey, you know what? Yeah, yeah. Uh, the past is the past. You know what I'm saying? And I'm all about, you know, not holding grudges and just leaving shit in the past where it belongs. So, yeah, why not? I will. Good luck out there. And maybe we'll both make that leap to the next level. Together. Yeah. Maybe. So, at Beth Phoenix, with regardless of what paths my former students choose, I'll never get over the thrill of seeing them out in the world and thriving. Aww. That's so nice.
All right, y'all. So we completed the we've come so far, but we got so far to go. So yeah, we've come so far and got so far. <clears throat> but yeah, y'all. <clears throat> anyway, uh, and we we earned the we unlocked the uh, piercings. So if want to you know get my girl some piercings as part of her entrance gear. Uh, we, we can definitely do that, but I uh, don't think I will. And it uh, looks like we got Mark Thompson and Tasia Meadows to talk to now. But uh, <clears throat> we won't be able to do that in this video because I think this will be a good stopping point for this video. So, yes, make sure y'all stay tuned for the next one, though, where we will be talking to both Mark and Tasia, which uh, should be rather interesting. But until then, it is your boy, Jason JV, reminding y'all to don't forget to like, comment, and, of course, subscribe if you haven't done so already. Don't forget to check out, of course, all the links in the video description down below. And, uh, yeah, till the next one, y'all have a blessed one. All right, peace.